Hello, this is Nurse GB. Oh, hi. I'm at the elementary school today. Whose little sister is it? Okay. Okay, well I can have him called down to the office and we can take a look at him. Yeah, we know how fast it spreads. Right. Okay. Well, when I have um, any students come in, I'll make sure to check them as well. But thanks for giving me the, the heads up. a student waiting for me. Okay. Okay. Yeah, thank you so much. Bye-bye. Hi there. Are you feeling okay? Um, yeah, I guess not, since you're here. Okay, well, I am new to this school. I don't think that I've seen your face before. Can you tell me your name? to meet you. You can just call me Nurse GB. Um, no. What grade are you in? Okay. And why are you here at the nurse's office? What well, doesn't feel good? Hmm. You scraped your elbows. I see that. And what were you doing to scrape them up like that? Jungle gym can be very dangerous, but, um, you know, it happens sometimes. It doesn't look too bad. Do you have a headache? Okay. Well, why don't you come in? Take a seat. Let me get to those arms first, little elbows. And then we can see about your headache. And I don't know if you heard me on the phone, but might do a little lice check on you, too. I would be surprised if I found anything, but it's good, too. Uh, you know, double, triple check. Okay, so. I got my first aid kit. You know what that is, obviously. And what I'm going to do is make sure that your scrapes are clean. Okay. So with that, I'm going to get a little pad here. And what I actually want to do is put on some gloves since there's a little bit of blood. It's not so bad. You know. A normal scrape. Oh, these are nitrile gloves. You don't have a nitrile allergy, do you? Yeah, well, we have a lot of people, a lot of kids come in with latex allergies, so we don't even keep them in the office anymore. Okay. So, I'm going to take a little bit of rubbing alcohol, and so this is gonna sting um, a little bit, like, don't be, don't be shocked, essentially. I'm just gonna go like this, get a little bit on the pad here. I'm gonna close the lid before I spill that all over the place. And I just want to see your arm. Yeah, that sting a little bit, sorry. Over nice and fast. We'll do it again for the other arm. I don't want to get an infection. That is no fun. Okay, so let me see this arm here. Okay. Okay. So, I'm gonna need to find bandage for you. I think... Oh, 
these are the ones I'm looking for. These will fold um, really nicely around the curves of your elbows. That way you can keep moving your arms and playing and not worry about ripping the band-aid off, which can be kind of uncomfortable. a little bit wet from the alcohol. Yeah, I just... There you go. Is that better? Okay. Oh, these gloves are too big. Okay. Get your arm out there. Is that? Now you said you had a headache. Um, when did the headache start? Okay, this morning. And on a scale from one to ten, how much does it hurt? Okay. Well, all right. Well, let's see if we can get you some medicine. I'm gonna look up your file. Let's see. You what's listed that's okay for you to have. Okay. Oh, one second. Hi, this is Nurse GB. Yeah, I needed to get the access code to the files. Yep, I realized that. Cheryl never gave it to me. Okay, great, thank you. Okay, got it. Bye bye. Okay, so, should be on this computer here. I had six grades, but I don't have your grades. Okay, and your last name. Okay, we're going to give you some. Advil. It should be pretty easy. It just comes in this little packet here. And if you want, you can get a cup of water from the um, water fountain behind you. And just put out your hand. Are you okay swallowing pills? Very good. Yeah, yeah, some people, some people can't do it, but it's not so bad once you figure it out. And that should help with your headache. Do you want an ice pack? Yeah, I can do that. Yep, I got the little mini fridge right under here. Ooh, this one's cold. This is, uh, it's gonna be really cold at first. If you want, uh, we can get you a paper towel. You okay? Are you sure? Alright, here you go. This is just gonna press up on your head like this. It is a little cold. Okay, let me get you a little rag here. in here. Do you want one? Okay. 
there's orange, green, red. You got red? Okay. That's the good nurse's office. Here you go. Just peel the top. So, uh, if you heard me on the phone when you came in, there was a bit of a lice outbreak over at the elementary school. So, do you mind, um, just while you sit here and recover, if I just take a little look? Okay. Yeah. Absolutely. I just have a little bit of a light right here. And then in my bag, this little tweezers and magnifying glass and a little stick to part your hair. Um, I'm going to want to put gloves on again. to your head and I just want you to just turn when I say to turn, okay? Put these gloves on first. I have to order them in smaller sizes. Don't know how big Cheryl was, but uh, her hands must have been big because I already have big hands. Okay. Yeah, she was kind of a short lady, so I'm kind of confused. But. All right. Do, 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 do. I am coming in armed. So what I'm going to do first is look around with my light and the stick just to make sure that there's nothing Major. Okay. Very good. Yep. If I could just get you to tilt your head down, that would be fantastic. Down. Like this. So you look at me. Major? Well, it takes a while for lice to, um, to mature. But if you got a couple of the major lice, they could lay eggs and get nets on this. Not pretty. Okay. I'm gonna want to get a little bit closer. I'm going to use this. Um, they're quite, 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 quite small, so I'm actually going to go around the side and look. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Uh-oh. I think I might see one. I 
must have spread uh, across schools. I'm gonna have you put your head up. Okay. And what I'm going to do is just remove a couple of the major ones. Um, so I'm going to just be... Okay. So, I am going to send you home. We definitely can't have you at school, unfortunately. Um, we're going to, and don't worry, we will make sure to not tell anybody if you don't want to tell anybody. Um, having lice is, I know, can be kind of scary, but it's not a big deal. It's just a nuisance, and you have to squash them out while you can, so. Actually, lice prefer very clean scalps, so they can uh, give it to us a compliment. Throw all this out here. So, let me write you a pass. Um, who did you have in class today? You came from music class. And that's with... Okay. And the time is... 20, so... Right before lunch. If you want, we can get one of your friends to grab you something from the cafeteria. So, who is the person that you would like me to call to come pick you up? Okay. Let me access those files. Okay, and is their phone number? Awesome, thank you. And I'm just going to write. is send you home with your headache and in a few hours we'll be doing our life check of the whole school okay yeah all right hi this is nurse gb over at the middle school yes Yes, unfortunately, they're going to need to be picked up. Well, there was a little bit of a lice outbreak over at the elementary school, and it seems as if it has come over here. Well, they did not get too lucky, unfortunately. They also have a bit of a headache, um, scraped up elbows, so honestly, it might not be too bad. For them to go home today uh, early anyway yep so we will actually be doing a full lice check of the entire school um well i assume that since it came from the elementary school yeah there's going to be a lot of kids with it absolutely so we'll also be sending out an email a little newsletter sort of memo just to let all the parents know um, what to do in, in in the case of lice. I'm gonna make sure you wash everything in very hot water. I'm gonna put things in black uh, plastic trash bags, and um, there are a couple lice treatments that um, that you can do at home. A couple of medicated ones and a couple of natural ones as well. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we can absolutely. Get all those details for you. It's no problem, yeah. Are you able to get to the school, pick them up? Okay, great. Great. Well, I already wrote their password of class, so I will make sure that they get their backpack and homework and everything all sorted so that um, when you arrive, your 
ready to go. All right. Okay, thank you so much. Bye-bye. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Um, I actually had lice two, three times in my life. Yeah, I guess it does come with working at a school. Only one of them was when I was in, uh, when I was in school myself as a student. Mm-hmm, the other two are nurse. Well, I used to work at the elementary, uh, across town. Yep. But, uh, Cheryl's on maternity leave now. Oh, sorry, the other is Mrs. Baker. Well, she just had her baby last week. Yeah, a baby boy. Mm-hmm. Um, so I'm filling in for her. So, now we just get to sit here and wait for you to be picked up. Yes. For your reflexes. Has the doctor never done this to you? Oh, yeah, here, you can try it out if you want. Oh, no, no, no. Here. You want to hit the part of your knee, just below your knee, and it should pop. Ready? Very good. And this knee. Very good. You could actually do it to your elbows as well, but I won't do that today because of um, little injuries over here. Well, let's see what else we have. Stickers. Well, they were more of a hit at the elementary school, but you are welcome to pick some. I wasn't sure if the middle school students were really gonna like them. Okay, here we have this pink tiger. I think it's pretty nice. We have. Some Valentine's stickers. Well, Valentine's Day passed, but um, they're still good. So, letters a B, B, mine, Bay. I am hip and with it. They give you letters. Ooh, some llamas. No prob llama. No prob llama. Well, you did so well today. And, um, you know, it's no fun. So. Donuts. Do not worry. Do not worry. Be happy. It's making me hungry. Got some cats with glasses. Speaking of hungry, did you want, um, did you want me to call in uh, your lunch order? Well, that's the best perk. You can get it to go. You already paid for it, so. Are you, you're on the meal plan? Awesome. Okay. Um, I think today is meatball subs. Is that okay? Hi, this is Nurse GB. I have a student going home, um, but we were just going to pick up their lunch. Yes. Um, so we could just get a meatball sub with french fries on the side, ketchup, and the side salad. Milk, lemonade. Could we do a chocolate milk and a lemonade? Thank you. Okay. Yep, I will have one of his classmates um, come pick it up. Thank you. Bye bye. All right. So who is 
one of your good friends in your class. Right? Okay. One more phone call. You said you're in music? Hi, this is Nurse GB. Yes, yes, and we're they're going home. We actually have a bit of a lice outbreak. Yes. But don't worry because um we'll be checking everybody. Probably um not until next period after lunch. We'll let everybody have their lunch. Yeah. Could we um send Ray up to grab the lunchbox? Okay. Awesome, thank you so much. Okay, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay. So, we have your lunch settled for you. And... Everything should be good to go. Now, I'm going to start getting everything set. And you just let me know if there's anything you need. Nothing as of now. Your lunch is coming. You've got your popsicle and your ice pack. Got your Advil. Wonderful. Alright. Well, I hope you feel better soon. And I hope to see you back in school very quickly.